everyone, welcome to Jewel Family Farms. I'm Scarlett and today we are going to be cutting soap and showing off some of our soaps. So it's been a while since you've seen me on the channel. So let's just get into the video. So this is some um, this is some soap I made yesterday. Um, it's just galaxy themed soap and ooh, with a glitter. <laughs> it is it has it's glycerin it's glycerin soap. Uh, I make the glycerin soap, um, and it has obviously glycerin, honey, goat milk powder, castor oil, colorants, glitter, blackberry, um, fragrance, and the colors in it are um, titanium dioxide for white, baby blue, and purple mica, and I mix some of the titanium dioxide with the blue, uh, baby blue and purple mica to make some lighter colors and I think it turned out really pretty. Ah, oh, look at that glitter. Okay, let's How get to How does it smell? It smells amazing. <laughs> it smells like blackberries. Mm. Okay, I need to stop smelling it now. I need to show up the other soaps. <laughs> okay. Alright. So this is mint soap that you made, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. And this is um, mint soap that Grammy made. It's for my father, am I correct? Yep. Gra um, Grammy made some mint soap for my dad. So this is made out of um, goat milk. Um, and it has olive oil, coconut oil, uh, neem oil. It has... Um, has it lard. has lard and um, oh, I, I put some beeswax in it, and I also put a little bit of mint that I uh, grew in the garden, crushed it up and put it in there. That's so fun. this is a really good uh, soap, um, and it smells really good. It's mint, so I'm really happy with that. Um, this will be up for sale in four weeks. I just made it yesterday, and since it has um, the hide, the lye in it, it takes four weeks for it to cure. Where Scarlet Soap is ready to go, it's ready to, for sale now, uh, it's just made of glycerin. It doesn't have any lye in it and it doesn't have any coconut oil in it. It's coconut oil free, so if anybody is allergic to coconut oil, this is this does not have any coconut in it. And um, all right, next soap. <laughs> Okay, so this is honey and oat. Honey, goat milk, honey, and oat soap. Yeah. And that's the fragrance. The okay. honey and oat is the fragrance. Yeah. It smells nice. <laughs> this is a really nice, this is a really good basic soap. And the, the oatmeal in it gives it just a little bit of an exfoliant. Um, it has goat milk olive oil, coconut oil, lard, hydrogen, okay, sodium hydroxide is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> it also has colorants in it, and like I said, the fragrance is um, honey and oats, and it smells really good. It's very, it smells very fresh. It's a very nice soap. Okay, the next one. This is cherry blossom. And it's a, it's a kind of a basic soap also. It um, has a fragrance of cherry blossom. It has um, goat milk, um, olive oil, coconut oil, lard, sodium hydroxide, colorants, and um, castor oil. And the, fra and the fragrance, like I said, is cherry blossom. And that is for sale now. These. Let me set the ones that's not for sale yet over. I'll set them over here. All of these are for sale. Okay. Oh, it says white house back here. This is my new soap. I made this. I'm trying to learn how to make my labels look a little bit nicer. So that's my new label. And this is goat milk soap with hemp oil. Hemp oil is very good for your skin. Um, it brings out, uh, it, it moisturizes your skin. As this is what 
hemp, this is what they say about the hemp oil. This is not what I'm saying. This is the um, definition of the hemp oil and what its medicinal purposes are. But it brings out natural oils in your skin and um, helps you. It also helps with people that have acne or, or skin, um, you know, blemishes of some sort. It kind of balances out the oils in the skin. That's what it says. That's what hemp oil says. That's what their statement is, not mine. So mm -hmm. it looks nice. Okay. No. This one smells so and good. The other one I have for sale, the hemp oil is not for sale yet. It'll be, it's going to be about three more weeks before this can be for sale. This is for sale now. This is the coconut. It smells like coconut. And it's uh, it smells like a set. very basic. It smells like so this has got goat milk coconut oil, olive oil, um, it has um, sodium hydroxide, um, castor oil, but it's a really nice, this is a, a slightly of a harder soap. So if you put, keep the soaps, if you don't, if you don't leave the soap sitting in water and you have like a, a dish a soap dish that hangs in your tub or has holes in the bottom where it can drain. These soaps last for weeks. They're not like the bar soaps that you buy at the grocery store and you might go through, you know, two or three soaps in a week. At least some of the soaps that I've used, that's what what's happened with me. I don't know. Maybe you buy different soaps and it lasts a week, but these will last you several weeks. But all of these right here are for sale right now. These are my brand new soaps. So, and now... We're going to start cutting the soaps we made yesterday. Okay. So this here oh, okay. is my blackberry soap. Oh, it's so pretty. And it smells so good. It dies. And this and, is her apple, and right? this is apple soap. This one is pro this probably has one of my favorite scents in it. It's so nice. Okay. Okay, let's cut the Scarlet's blackberry. going to take them out, and we're going to cut these out. Ooh, look at that. Uh -oh. Ooh. Kind of soft, don't you think? Mm -hmm. I want Ooh. it soft. Okay. That's be. Oh my gosh. That's beautiful. Okay, you want to hold the camera while let me cut this soap? Okay. Okay, we try to cut these as close to four ounces as possible, so. Mess with it a bit. Mess with it just a little bit. It's so pretty. Look at that. Okay. Let's try this one. Show that off. Oh my gosh. That is one beautiful soap. Supposed to be four ounces, not five. Oh dear. So let me scoot this back just a tad. It's hard to adjust. It's hard to figure it out because, um, depending on how heavy your soaps are, some soaps are heavier than others. Some are thicker. Some are taller. So it's a little bit. It's it's very hard to get these measurements exactly right. So that's why on the package I always put approximately four ounces and I try to get it as approximate as I can but you know sometimes it goes over sometimes it goes a little less and that's just the way it is it's so it's cutting so easily compared to how mine did <laughs> well yours is made out of glycerin and this is not so it's a yeah. difference in the texture of what you make your soap out of mm-hmm all right let's come back here Glycerin's a lot harder. All right, 4.2, so that's closer. So that's good. 4.2 is good. I'd rather give a little more than a little less, if possible. That is very, I, that is, that really is a pretty, <laughs> I love the top of that soap. It is really so pretty, and all the colors in it. I tried to figure out, you know, what I would think blackberry would look like, and, you know, yeah. I hoped, I kind of helped with the colors of the apple one. Mm-hmm. 
of course it measures that one 4.3 so see it just it depends on how tall it gets in the middle compared to the sides and I got some sorry <laughs> seems to be what we're going for here. I'm going to show off one. So pretty. 4.3. 4 4.3 4 is the number. Okay. We should return. That's how I, I, this is how I, you know, cut and measure my soaps and um, get everything ready. Okay, so all right. I had a couple of uh, places that wanted me to, to sell soaps at their store, and True Value was one of them. And um, Ace Hardware, right? Oh, was it Ace? Yeah, maybe it was Ace Hardware. Yeah, I think it was Ace Hardware. Okay. Because I remember sitting in the car waiting for you, and then you brought me back that news. <laughs> yeah, so I'm trying to get some soaps ready for that, and got it. <laughs> All right. They're very soft. Yeah. Uh -oh. All right. It's okay. That will be a sample. <laughs> yeah. Alright, let me cut the samples off. There we go. Get a good glimpse of that. Cut off my sample here. Ooh! I like that. This is apple. Alright. Let's see how this one comes up. Let me move these out of the way. Whoop. Look how pretty. See, the gold does look nice. Yeah, it does look nice in there. Oh, we didn't, did, uh, like we didn't say what ingredients were in these. Oh, okay. We'll do that after. We'll do after. Four point three. Right, I'm gonna show that off a little. Close. I'm gonna move this up just a tad. If you want color for soaps, this is the place to be. So this was our red apple, green apple, a golden delicious apple. This is, you know, I don't know, my version of an apple. 4.2. Scarlet wanted to put the gold colored in there, and I thought, oh, that sounds really nice. 4.2. It, it looks nice with the different colors of like red yeah. and green. Yeah. I like the way the top came out though. I mean, that's really, it, you know, maybe an apple branch, you know, with a leaf oh, on it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's what it reminded me of. <laughs> it's so fun when you're making soap and you use your different colors and you do your different designs on the top and, and you just can't wait to see how the insides come out. It, okay. All right, so anyway, let me finish up this real quick. We don't have much time left. And all the, this soap and this soap back here are all made with goat milk, coconut, olive oil, sodium hydroxide, uh, castor oil, and colorants, of course. And then this is um, apple, and this is blackberry. So all of these soaps here are not up for sale yet. It would be four weeks before these are for sale. The ones that are for sale are the Galaxy Soaps, the Coconut Soap, 
the honey and oat and milk soap and the cherry blossom soap. Those are the ones that are up for sale right now. And this, right? Nope, not oh, that. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's for my dad. Yeah. My bad. So, anyway, um, uh, like and subscribe, and um, we're going to try to do some more videos on different things soaps and making also my pie, pies and different things. I don't know. We're just going to do a whole bunch of different videos. So, thank you everybody for watching. We hope you enjoy our channel. Come back and see us. God bless. Bye, everyone. Bye. God bless.